Remember this morning. I want you all to remember if you have any of the dead situations, you maybe you're living in a dead, dead place, a dead situation. I tell you, remember God loves you. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. This is what I want to conclude. Remember, you know, God has got a paid a price for you to pay all your debts. Amen. Hallelujah. Let it be a physical debt. And let it be a spiritual day. He paid a price. Remember, God loves you. Amen. Hallelujah. Can you say, God loves me? Amen. Hallelujah. God loves you. God loves you. And God gives you a second chance. Maybe someday you die. Lord, let your resurrection power come to me. Amen. Hallelujah. Let your resurrection power empower me so that I can serve you. God is giving a word reminding you. Amen. Hallelujah. Remember, He is there when you call on Him. Amen. Hallelujah. We don't need to be worried, my people. We don't need to be disturbed. We don't need to, you know, uh, what I can say. We don't need to be alarmed. God is says, call unto me. I'll be there. Amen. Hallelujah. My God is a good God. They just call unto the Lord. With all their ignorance, God has answered them. Amen. Hallelujah. Because, you know, God knows the heart. They love me. That's the reason they came. If they don't love me, they don't come. Maybe a tradition, doesn't matter. But they love me, they came. So when you love God, even though you're in wrong, God will meet you. Amen. Hallelujah. God will remember you. My son, no, this is not the place for you. My son, this is not the church for you. My son, this is not the fellowship for you. My son, this is not the people for you. God will remind you and bring you back where you belong to. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God is remembering this morning. He's telling us to, hey, my son, tell my people, I remember them. Amen. Hallelujah. In other words, I'm, I'm making you remember the God's promises in your life. Amen. Once he's spoken, he's spoken. Amen. Hallelujah. Once he's spoken, he's spoken. He never leave you, nor forsake. If he said that, he said, I have plans and purpose for you. Jeremiah 29. I have plans and purpose for you. And the plans will be fulfilled as long as you seek the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. People of God, I just wanted to conclude this morning. Glory be to God. Just one thing I tell you. When the remembered church, listen to this one word carefully. When you remember, your direction will change. Amen. Hallelujah. When you remember, your understanding will change. Till then, they wanted to go to the dead body. Now, when God reminded them, oh, they are so happy. Their direction changed. You know, their direction is no more to the grave, to the society. Amen. Hallelujah. When you remember the promise of God, you will come back where you have to be. When you remember the plans of God, you'll come back where you have to be so that you can serve God. Amen. Hallelujah. And their behavior change, their direction change, more than anything, their destiny change. Amen. Hallelujah. Today, we are talking about Mary Magdalene because God remembered her. Amen. Hallelujah. Isn't it? Today, you're talking about apostles because their destiny has been changed. If God can change the destiny of those people, I tell you with all the confidence, God can change you this means of your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Can you say what? Amen. amen. Can we thank God? Hallelujah. Because He lives. Can we sing that? Can we all stand and sing that simple chorus? Whatever happened, doesn't matter. God is in control. Maybe dead places, God can revive them. Maybe dead situations, God can revive. And let me tell you this word is coming to me. What language you use at home? Is it dead language? Dead situations. Remember everything. If it's a dead language, change your language. God will allow His Spirit to move upon the dead places. Your dead families, dead children. When I say dead children, they're not in the Lord. Dead children means not they're dying. They're not in the Lord. Every dead situation, my God is going to change. You know why? Because He lives. Amen.
nation may rise because of the living power of God. Not every dead family, I speak your word in Jesus' name. Not every dead situation, I speak your revival in the name of Jesus. Lord, whatever the dead challenges, Lord, let your power, the resurrection power, touch your people of God. Empower them, renew them, let them remember every word that you have spoken into their life and I see it in the name of Jesus Lord. Let there be salvations, let there be healing, let there be revival, let there be reunions, let there be peace and prosperity in the families because you live with God. Yes.